Hello Capricorn and welcome to your weekly reading for January 13th through the 20th. We have everything set out here and ready to go. The three stones that will help you the most this week are lava, which is all about change, grounding yourself, it stabilizes your emotions, clears your thoughts, and aids in transformation. We have feldspar, which helps you to let go of the past, brings in creativity and innovative thinking. And we have mahogany obsidian, which is very protective. It repels negativity, especially negative people. Very grounding, removes energy blockages, and helps you reclaim your power. So we've already got several uh, stones that are talking about grounding and stabilizing. Your rune this week is the Gibo rune, which is the gift rune, gift and relationships, unity or union or partnership, balance and generosity. So let's get started with your reading Capricorn. Your first reading your first uh, card is the card of change, and I'm not surprised. Your stones already said that about change. The Great Mystery. The Great Mystery card tells you that where you are right now in your life is 100% your responsibility. Drop the shame, blame, and regret. It is, you put yourself there, you can uh, change it if you like, but don't blame other people. Your third card here, Hour of Power, Ritual of Joy. That's an awesome card. And the Storyteller card, Expansion. Expansion of your beliefs, of your ideas, your dreams, your story. And that goes right back with the great mystery. What story do you tell? You can change that story. And Hyoka reminds us to have some fun. Don't be too serious. Some of this is a little serious, but... You need to laugh, too. Broken Arrow. Embrace the energy of peace. And we have the mountains. Stand your ground. The Magic Guardian. Unlock the magic within. Every single person that is born on this earth has magic within them. The High Priest intend and create. Make sure that your intentions are very very clear. That's very important before you start creating. And Medicine Mother honor your inner knowing. The moon card say, have faith in your dreams. Work through your fears. Emotions are running high. Remember to look at the bigger picture.
and you got what do you need to release dragonfly spirit says truth transcends illusion that may be going back to this original uh, mystery card in the storyteller your story a lot of people may have a, an idea of what your story is but only you know and truth transcends illusion eagle spirit spirit has your back that's always awesome cow spirit says that the miracles are endless but sometimes that takes work on your part. Sometimes you have to let go of things for miracles to happen. So we're going to clarify that. Koi fish spirit says there is always enough. And frog spirit reminds you to clear the clutter. You can't uh, bring new people into your life, new ideas or dreams into your life, unless there is room for them. Unless you have cleared out the clutter and made a space. Your stone people card is Coco Pelly, which also tells you to have a little bit of fun. Coco Pelly also is the card of planting seeds and those seeds will come to fruition they will grow so your dreams um, and ideas will manifest if you put in the work okay and then we are going to clarify what do you need to release and uh, work through your fears what is Holy Capricorn back. What do they need to release? Or how can they release this safely and with grace? And emotions are running high. What can Capricorn do here? What will help? What is going to help Capricorn release this week? Let's see what the cards have for you, Capricorn. <laughs> the giveaway ceremony, the card of release. Give away things that you don't need anymore, but also give away those negative thoughts, maybe, or habits. Star Ancestor says, follow the voice of your soul. That will tell you what needs to be released. When you do that, your hard work is paying off. Oh, and then at the end, oh, you got the butterfly card. That's just perfect. Transformation is beautiful. It may take a little work, Capricorn, but you will be able to transform. So we're going to place our stones now. We have the lava, and we're going to go ahead and just, it is about change. So we're going to put that on the change card, the rites of passage. Feldspar, let go of the past. We're going to put that on the release card. Mahogany obsidian is protective, repels negativity, it's grounding. We're going to put that on emotions are running high. In the gift rune, let's see here. Let's 
such a gift. Let's put that on the embrace the energy of peace. Peace is one of the greatest gifts that we can ever receive. I hope you enjoyed your reading Capricorn. Have a wonderful week. Remember, ah, transformation is beautiful. Peace, love, and light. Until next time.